I'm Adele Ang. I'm a physiotherapist at Focus Pilates Private Limited in Singapore. Today we'll be doing bridging on the leather barrel. This is a fairly advanced exercise and it should be done only after you have done other simple exercises with other equipment in the studio. So what we're going to do is get Kim to come around and lie on the barrel so that you can take a look at what the movement or what the exercise entails, what she needs to do. Basically, as you can tell from this position, you're getting a lot of thoracic extension. So before doing this exercise, she would have done a lot, a host of body exercises to get her into this position. <coughs> and for here, we're going to get traction through the lumbar spine. She's actually lengthening her tailbone down towards the floor. And there's a lot of hip flexion, so we're getting a lot of hip mobility here. So it's useful for people who are very stiff into hip flexion. Okay, from this position, she's going to bridge. So she's going to tilt her pelvis posteriorly, lengthen up towards the ceiling. She's unfolding from her hips into extension. So from here, you get very good glutes work, hamstring work, and she's maintaining neutral spine. There's no extension into her lower back as well as mobilization through a thoracic spine. Okay, from here, she's going to segmentally roll down. So this is really good for getting the active segmental movement that they need from their thorax area and flexion into the hip. And once again, in that position, she's lengthening her lumbar spine down, creating that nice traction through her lower back that she needs, creating that space that she needs in the gist. And you can also work on some thoracic breathing here. One more time, bridging up and then lengthening into the legs, reaching long. So in Pilates, we, meant we emphasize a lot on length. In this position, she's maintaining length. There's no compression through the lower back. Okay, from here, slowly coming back down. And Thank you, Kim. You can come around. So slowly. Thank you for watching.